Michael Manicellis from Dyn Audio. They have a new music line of speakers that are wireless, Bluetooth, and we want to learn more about them, so I'm going to turn this over to Mike, and he's going to describe the new line. Well, the music series is a line of four all-in-one models from Dyn Audio that are Wi-Fi enabled. They do have Bluetooth built in as well. And the beauty of the Wi-Fi capabilities is that you could input your title account information, for example, and it does come with a free nine month subscription to title, by the way. And you can create dedicated stations and profiles. There's five presets on each speaker, so you could have different channels dedicated to each family member, for example, or to different moods, different genres of music, internet radio stations. I mean, it's really the world of music at your fingertips. Um, The app is quite intelligent in the sense that there's a music now feature which lets you configure profiles based on your music tastes and preferences so you can input your favorite artists or genres and it'll give you more selections and you create a profile and it'll actually suggest other artists or bands or songs etc that you might be interested based on your preferences in the algorithm and you can create a channel basically called music now up to the player, one button, and again, it'll just start playing your music. You don't have to have your phone or device with you to access title. It's already, you know, pre-configured once you do your user settings. This app also has the ability to set two different modes for the speakers. One's called Noise Adapt, which adjusts the equalization to the ambient noise of the room. So if you're in a showroom environment, heavy retail, a party, anything that would be a little bit more loud, it'll equalize for that. Versus if, let's say, a dealer had in a dedicated audio sound room, it'll balance the equalization to the ambient noise levels of that situation. There's also something called Room Adapt, which will automatically, on the fly, adjust the equalization to the room position. So if you move it from freestanding to a corner or you know, a different placement in the room, it'll adjust automatically via DSP to that. So huge sonic advantages based on those technologies. Combining the DSP platform with Dynaudio drivers, these are authentic Dynaudio drivers, the same core materials that are utilized in all the Dynaudio models up from the Evidence Masters, you know, our flagship speaker. So again, this is real high-end audio performance, but in a lifestyle type package. The two smaller models, which are the $550 Music 1 and the uh, $700 Music, Music 3, sorry, are battery powered too. So you could take them outside, you could, uh, pair them, you could create stereo pairs out of any of the speakers right in the app quite simply. And then the two larger models, the Music 5 and the Music 7, actually could be used as sound bars. Um, you know, we have Toslink inputs on both of them. We have a HDMI and audio return channel on the Music 7. So you do have a lot of flexibility in terms of the applications that all these products could be utilized in. And you mentioned uh, the ability to touch and use the device minus an app was a big Absolutely. feature. So these are the presets on top of the speaker on the side of the two smaller ones. And basically... And you can pair. You haven't even touched the app yet today. So. <laughs> That's the nice. grills are from the acclaimed Danish textile house called Gabriel. So this is also an interior decorator friendly uh, industrial design, I think. How much is the... Uh... So $8.49 for the Music 5, $10.99 for the Music 7. And the differences between the two? Well, other than the larger size and additional drivers is the uh, HDMI input and the audio return channel on the Music 7. But otherwise, the basic topology of all the models is the same. They have the same feature sets. It's just the different form factor. And these are now shipping. Good. So they're we're ready to go, ready to roll. So uh, what's your favorite test track, personally? 
I don't have his favorite test track. I can honestly say that. Favorite artist? No. <laughs> Negative. Anybody who knows me knows who my favorite artist is. So. All right. Well, I'll we'll find out. That band we'll find out. We, we can go with Joy Division, Afghan Wigs, uh, oh, Smith. Some good bands. <laughs> some good oh, bands. Oh, a different kind of... Uh, okay, so my, my soundtrack pick of the year. Um, oh, well, let's not forget Catherine Wheel. One of the best bands ever. Soundtrack pick of the year? Soundtrack pick of the year, Baby Driver. Nice. It's it's 24 of the best curated tracks I've ever heard. And music you've... Artists you'll know, but songs you've never heard. Really killer. Gotcha, gotcha. Simon, anything else? What are the the controls on this one? Well, these are the presets. So, uh, on the Dynaudio Music app, Here's the app, yeah. Simon. You can set up different presets. So on this system, somebody has a couple of radio stations and PR. Mine, I trust you, would look quite different. <laughs> and that's, again, you could, you could customize these to your liking. You could do a favorite song, a favorite artist, like the favorite radio station, favorite album, favorite genre, and it's all configurable in the menu, so. You know, I think what we like is a little bit more of the different settings here. You could change the settings for the intelligent uh, noise adapt and then the room adapt. setting up the profiles. There might be a little latency right now because the router is in the other room or the other door closed here, but you can see different settings based on you know my personal preferences. So and there's the title account. Mm-hmm. You link your title account to it. Simple, stupid. Well, we love the whole idea of wireless home audio. Absolutely, and Dynaudio was a pioneer in terms of pioneering wireless loudspeakers. In 2012, we were the first high-end company really, you know, getting into the uh, game with the first-generation Zios. Music line is now like a, a fourth-generation type product for us because we've had the first and second-gen Zios. We had the Focus XDs, which are now on their second gen, and uh, we're even having some new Zio models coming out just uh, in the next couple of weeks as well with the ZO20 and 30 models. So, you know, we're gonna keep, you know, how would you say, I mean, just keep refining, you know, the wireless technology to merge it with IN because one of the things about wireless is that, you know, being in a specialty two-channel audio company, we be at dealers often and customers come and ask about wireless. The high-end dealers, well, we don't sell wireless. Wireless is crap, wireless isn't good. I think that audio has changed the narrative of that, and uh, we've demonstrated that you can combine the convenience of wireless operation with uncompromised sound quality and true high-end heritage. I mean, these drivers that are utilizing these models, they're not, you know, a lower grade of technology by any means. It's the same core materials and technologies that we've built our reputation on, and I think uh, the proof is ultimately in the pudding, you know? Thank you very much. Thank you so much for your time, gentlemen, and... uh, Everybody check out the Don Audio Music and the Zeo and the Focus XDs and even our two-channel products. Don Audio is a great line of products and, uh, you know, it's all about the music. So, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you so much.
heart is telling me one thing, is my mind telling me another, should I be or not? 